Hey, what's up guys? I want to show you a new little thing I found that um, can allow you to two-tick anglerfish without being on a PvP world. And as you can tell, there's a rat right here that I lured from over there. So now, basically, if I have uh, airstrike as my autocast, I can now click this rat every two ticks and catch anglers. So this is just a quick little guide on how to set this up. Um, I know a lot of hardcores uh, want to stock up on anglerfish for bossing. So, but also two tick has always just kind of been known to be a PVP world thing. So this is now completely safe for hardcores to do. Um, I don't have my rod as blessing on right now, but if you have a rod as blessing, definitely wear it. You'll get, uh, I think a 10% chance at two dark crabs per catch. So yeah, the, I think the XP for this method is about 50 K, uh, fishing XP an hour. It, Cause it's basically what you're doing is I think anglers are normally like 20 K an hour. And you basically just multiply that by 2.5 because it becomes, instead of a five tick action, it becomes a two tick action. So I'm going to show you, I'm going to just murder this route real quick and show you how to set it up. So let me show you real quick. First of all, you're going to want to tag the rat because there's a million rats over there. So I will show you where the rat initially spawns. Let me just murder this real quick. You will need an alt though, because the rat... The rat can stay by that boat, but it eventually despawns after five minutes. So I'm gonna kill this one again. I'm gonna show you where this one spawns. A sec. All right, so it spawns around right here and you'll see it. You wanna uh, hold shift click, right click it, and then tag it so you know for future reference. But you're basically just gonna run over here. Do not walk too far you want to walk to right here just like the tile that's this boat just the tile ahead of it and then you can run this swarm will occasionally get in the way you just have to maneuver it and then you move over here and now it's stuck so now what you do on your alt account is here let me just move it the alt account basically just despears at once And then it'll aggro. Oh wait. <laughs> I actually have to hit it. One sec. I guess you actually have to hit it. Luckily I hit a zero. And then it'll aggro. I guess the D spear doesn't actually aggro. So be sure to like air strike it first. And now I'm gonna move. Oops. I guess that's yeah, there we go. So now it's aggroed onto that, that account. And now on this account that you can see, you just do the same thing and that's how it's set up. So that's a little, I guess, I guess a little guide on how to do this for hardcores. You can also do this easily on a PVP world, just attacking somebody else. But I thought I'd show you guys. And if these two spots right here move, by the way, it just means you have to go further out and it's a little bit tougher to click the rat, but it works the exact same. Usually one of these three spots are available to do it. But yeah, it does take some click precision, so preferably you do this when the uh, the spots are right there. Oops, and I accidentally killed it. By the way, if you accidentally airstrike, that's a, that's a good thing I did that. If you accidentally airstrike and it doesn't uh, KO it, it actually won't aggro onto your guy that airstriked it. It'll actually can, after like three ticks, it'll just go back to attacking the same account. So that's kind of nice. That's something I found. There is a way to get a rat over here on this dock as well with your alt. But I think just having the rat right there is a little bit more convenient for the two spots right here. And again, if you're not a hardcore Iron Man, you can just go to a PvP world and attack your alt as long as it's within your combat bracket. Um, and yeah, so that's a little guide for you guys. Hope you guys enjoyed. Um, I will have just some of the calculations in the description uh, and anything I missed. This is just 
just recorded it real quickly, no editing involved, so there'll probably be thing, some things I missed, but yeah, thanks for watching.